I never hit record. Oh, I did hit record. Hey guys, it's Brett and welcome back to my channel. I was like a couple months ago now, I watched Christine Simply Nail Logical. She organized all of her 2000 nail polishes in rainbow order. I guess it inspired me in a way. Maybe I should organize my 150 plus CDs in color order on my desk. There are pros, there are cons. Right now they are organized by artist and by release date. Right here, this entire shelf is Hannah Montana and Miley Cyrus. All of it organized lovely by release date. But now they're just gonna be freaking everywhere because they're all different colors. So that's not great, but at the same time, I'm willing to sacrifice it, you know? I'm also debating, I have some books here, I also have some movies here. I'm thinking I should maybe take all that out and just have CDs. I'm just gonna get into it and see where it takes us. So step one, I think, should be cleaning off my desk because my room is a disaster. Want some candy? Remember this puzzle that fell down? Still haven't put it back up. <laughs> I should also say, fairly recently, I did do like organizing my CDs by color like on my floor. But see, that's very, very different. This is gonna be displayed, like this is all there's gonna be. That was just organizing them. I wanted to make them look cool and it didn't. So don't get it twisted. I'm not remaking the same video twice. Okay, so like here's the issue. Mariah Carey Rainbow, the side is literally a rainbow. Maybe I'll put it with red, cause like that's the middle color. I, I guess I really don't know what to do here. All right, I've got everything pretty much by color now. I would say the big glaring issue here is that primarily we have black album covers and white album covers, which is the same issue I had when I organized them on my floor. What I'm thinking is, I'll start with white, then move into pink, then move to red, then do orange, yellow, green, blue, whatever, purple, and then from purple, go into like, shift into like the black and gray. I think that is the the trajectory here, to use my professional terms. Shut up. <laughs> what are you even saying anymore? I just had a thought. If this looks stupid, do you know how long it's gonna take me to put back together? <laughs> I, I, I guess I'm done. <laughs> I guess I don't know if you can really see that well from back there. I can bring the camera in later, but I'm... There you go. Because I took out all the movies and books, for some reason in my mind, I thought after I took those things out, I'd still have enough CD to fill this. And I um, definitely do not. I could put the movies, will they fit? Whoops. Let's do the movies, color-coded. <laughs> uh. Okay, so I stacked movies by size, so it looked organized-ish. But, so like, it looks okay. At best. Here, I'll take my phone and give a little a little tour. So obviously we start with the whites, move into color, and then like this is all the color right here, and that's in the black already. So I just did black the whole way down, and then down here, and then I shifted kind of into the more grays and silvers, whatever. And then there's the movies. <laughs> Yikes! I'm not a fan, but. You know what? Maybe I'll even like it better, I'm thinking, once once I get more CDs, inevitably, and I fill the rest up, maybe that'll look better? I don't, I really don't know. Maybe I can even fill this big section up. If I get all that fill of CDs, I think it'll look better. So, here's to the future of me having money and getting CDs. Let's just wish this into existence. So I guess that's all. This was not that exciting of a video. I feel kind of bad, but maybe editing will make it more fun. <laughs> it was so stupid. So yes, thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.